So problem showering with pots and autonomic systems is way high on the list of what people talk about. Almost to a person when people come in, they describe that they don't like putting their hands over their head, don't like getting in a hot shower. The simple advice to give would be to give hacks that would help you to be able to exist while doing that. You get a shower chair so you can sit down. You don't take a hot shower so the blood doesn't pool in your skin. You try to manage your hands over your head. Maybe you have somebody else wash your hair or you wash your hair in the sink, etc. Like So these are all things that people have figured out and they're all hacks. But I think the deeper question in that or the thing that is worth actually talking about is why do you want to find a way to continue to operate that way? To me, it's too pervasive that people actually like buy into the fact that life will get zero percent better than struggling to shower and laying in bed all day and feeling like you're not going to do anything with your life. Your life is only so long. There's only so many days. And everyone you feel that way, you don't get to have it back. So I struggle with that a bit because my desperate desire for people to see a different way to live and a different way to pursue health coming from a very low spot of being that sick. And what's frustrating is that we see people every single day that just keep ticking up the ladder, working hard, but improving. And it breaks my heart every time I see people that talk about how hopeless they are and how they'll never feel better and the comfort that they take in that. And I get that. I get that there's comfort in the surrender, but also there's so much hope in the pursuit of learning more and doing more and trying to figure out the actual problem underneath so you can solve it. And all the time we waste feels like time wasted. So my advice, even if it does feel harsh, would be maybe not so much to worry about the hacks and the tricks and the way that we get around stuff. It would be to face it and figure out how to fix it and work really hard at that and build your life again. It's not meant to be harsh. It's just meant to like try to get you to consider that there could be a better life for you.